Hello everyone, welcome back. This video will be a little different from what you're used to seeing on my channel. In an effort to release videos more frequently, I've decided to try doing some reviews, or maybe more accurately overviews, of some of the interesting items that I purchase with projects in mind. For example, this video will be featuring this ultrasonic fogger. The fogger has a piezoelectric element inside, which sends high-frequency, very high-energy vibrations into the water. This high-frequency vibration causes pressure spikes to form at the surface, which forces some of it to atomize into tiny droplets. The majority of traditional foggers that you're probably used to seeing use a heating element to produce fog, and so the fog comes off hot and tends to rise in the air. With this ultrasonic method, the fog is produced cold, and so it tends to be heavier than air and stay in whatever container it's formed in. I either need to use airflow to lift the fog out of the container, or put the fogger in a shallower dish if I want it to pour over the sides. The hot coil foggers that I was talking about before primarily use a mixture of water and vegetable glycerin to produce a thick fog. I wanted to experiment and see if this fogger would produce denser smoke with the addition of this glycerin. The addition of glycerin didn't seem to affect the fog production from this ultrasonic fogger, I suppose because the fog is produced cold, and glycerin probably requires heat to properly vaporize. One of the more interesting applications for a fogger like this that you may not immediately think of is to vaporize fuel or solvents for cleaning purposes. There's potential to use these ultrasonic vibrations to aerosolize fuels that would otherwise not be compatible with modern engines. Okay, I think that's enough for this video. Let me know in the comments if you enjoyed this and if you'd like to see more videos of this kind in between my larger projects. If I continue, I'll likely be making changes to the format as I go along, so leave your suggestions below. Thanks for watching.